Hey folks, it's me, your favorite president, back with episode 21 of The Trump Show. As you may have noticed, it was the Remix Brothers and their hit single, Indict the MF, that received the most votes to be the show's new theme song. So thanks to everyone who voted, and don't worry if you were hoping for theme two, it will still be featured in the closing credits. Not that we have closing credits, I mean it's YouTube for fuck's sake, but we'll slip it in somehow. Speaking of slipping it in, let's go now to my gal on the street, the one and never lonely, Lauren Bobo Bobert. Hey Big Daddy. How's it hanging, bra? All good, girlfriend. I'm here with two of my biggest fans, Jimbo and Reggie, two all-American patriots who love the USA even more than playing Call of Duty and rubbing one out to old Victoria's Secret catalogs. Well, that's a pretty high bar. Hi, Jimbo and Reggie. Can you guys tell me what you like best about Bobo? Well, sure, President Trump. That's an easy one. She's a Second Amendment defender, and we love that. Her conservative values, such as limited government, individual liberty, and free market principles. All good stuff. Anything you want to add, Jimbo? We love the way she grabs are wieners. Okay, now it's all making sense. Let's go now to this video of Putin Schill, Alabama senator who lives in Florida, and recently said of Joe Biden, I'm afraid he's going to fall down every time I turn on the television. This is Tommy Tuberville. Holy crap, that is good stuff. Thanks for flying Karma Airlines, asshole. I could watch this all day. It's surprisingly easy to hate a guy whose last name literally means potato town. Time now for the Trump news of the week. Of course, the biggest story is, I was hit with a freaking gag order. Can you believe it? Judge Chutkin has barred me from attacking court staff, Jack Smith, or his team and witnesses. It seems that old maid Chutkin thinks that me calling for the execution of potential witnesses deserves a gag order for fuck's sake. I mean, seriously, who is she to judge? Next thing you know, she'll say, I need a spanking for posting Letitia James's home address on Truth Social. Here's the Google map for that if anyone's interested. And just for the record, getting spanked doesn't scare me as long as you use a rolled up Forbes magazine with my face on the cover. Another story that made a big splash was this leaked video. But remember, Republicans eat their young. They really do. They eat their young. Terrible statement, but it's true. First of all, that was a private video of me in my home having a private conversation with a private video camera. And whoever leaked it should be executed along with all those who testify against me. I'm serious. We should have one big execution party for all the treasonous bastards who dare to defy me. Me. We could hold it at one of my rallies, you know. Really make it a thing. We'll hang a few. Firing squad for some. Maybe a few electric chairs to add some zip. We'll have cotton candy, snow cones, maybe a kissing booth. I bet the turnout will be huge. Massive crowd at Trump's enemies execution party. Record-breaking crowds. In other news, my son Don Jr. is still a massive douchebag. Check this out. The high interest rates combating the inflation has made home ownership almost impossible for many Americans. Okay, son, I have one question for you. Go ahead, shoot, dad. Why for fuck's sake do you make videos for your dumbass podcast when you can't even talk? It's the damn booger sugar, pops. I knew you were gonna say that. Let's once more go back to my favorite farm girl, Bobo, who appears to be doing some sort of photo shoot. That's right, Big Daddy. You see, a prominent Democratic lawmaker recently said that I was about as smart as a bale of hay. You don't say? And personally, I thought that was a terrible insult to bales of hay. So I decided to set up a photo shoot with some of my intellectual equals here. Interesting tactic. LOL. Anywho, we're on a break right now, so I wanted to show you some video I took on the House floor yesterday with my super cute grandson. G -G Go, go, go. Wow, Bobo, you are right. That is a very handsome baby. It's strange because as a rule, I hate all children, but that one is just different. I know, right? He's so fun and so handsy. Just like me. Go, 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 yum, yum, ta -tas. As many of you know, last Saturday, our boy Scared Ketchup debuted his latest AI 4K MAGA Mercial, MAGABOTS. And trust me, folks, these little extreme right robots are already a smash hit. Let's check in now with a few of these lovable little fascist androids and see how their newfound fame has changed their lives. Hello, President Trump. Thank you for having us on your show today. It's truly an honor and a pleasure to be here. That goes double for me, Mr. Trump. I uh, have no idea where I am right now. Okay, then let's start right there. Where the hell are you guys? We are currently 
in our Magabot escape pod, traveling at light speed heading for Magabot Base Camp 1 on planet Gaffion in the Filibustera star sector. One more time in English, please. Escape pod? What are you escaping from exactly? Well, sir, at precisely 0900 hours, Magabot Star Cruiser 1 was fired upon by a rogue Antifa bot battle cruiser. So the four of us made the choice to let our Magabot comrades stay and fight while we turned our titanium tails and hauled some space ass out of there. So what you're telling me is that you all are pathetic, spineless cowards? Exactly. exactly. Can you uh, repeat the question? Wowza, you're so much like your human counterparts. It's really uncanny, isn't it? So I hear you losers are going to take us out with a song, is that right? Yes, Mr. President, but before we do, we want to add a WLB clock to the screen. You see, ever since the last few Scared Ketchup videos included musical numbers, he's had several negative comments from YouTubers complaining that having songs in the videos is annoying and that it's ruining the brand. So the WLB clock is for those people who hate the music bits, to let them know exactly how far they need to fast forward to avoid having their precious eardrums assaulted by our top-notch harmonies. In this case, it's a minute and 15 seconds. And what exactly does WLB stand for? Whiny little bitches. Oh, did you just hear that? It was the sound of several WLBs unsubscribing. Okay, let's do this, guys. Take it away, Mitch. That's your cue, Mitch. Uh... Come on, Mitch, this is you, buddy. <laughs> is he asleep with his eyes open? This happens a lot. Can you give us a second, sir? Okay, while we wait for them to resuscitate old fart dust, please remember, folks, if you want scared ketchup to keep the videos coming on YouTube, please consider hitting that super thanks, buy me a coffee link, or use the PayPal address to send the boy a little cheddar. Wake the fuck up, Mitch! Holy mother of Christ, I'm awake, goddammit. Okay, I think we're ready. Folks, these are the MAGABOTs. MAGABOTs. Find me somebody to love. Find me somebody to love. Find me somebody to love. Find me somebody to Somebody need somebody to love. Somebody need somebody to love. Somebody, somebody, somebody. I got nobody. Find me somebody to love. Yeah, to love. Find me somebody to love. Find me somebody to love. Somebody, somebody, oh, somebody. Gotta find me somebody to love. Can anybody find me? Somebody to love, won't you find me someone to love? Find me, find me somebody to Mr. Spore Rock, did the photon torpedo take out the target? I regret to inform you, Captain Brandon, that the escape pod and all four Magabot occupants made the successful jump to hyperspace. What the hell, Spore Rock? Are you kidding me? I'm just fucking with you, man. We blew those MAGA fools to smithereens. <laughs> yeah. You're killing me, Spore Rock. You're killing me. <laughs>